here at Stumptown because Stumptown has been a pioneer of the cold brew coffee movement and more recently the nitro coffee movement. So let's try some drinks. Yeah, let's do it. So this is Stumptown's cold brew. Cold brew first. The one thing I will say is that Stumptown coffee is very strong, especially in cold form. Brace yourself. It's really low in acidity. It's really smooth. I get this like really nice nutty aftertaste as well. Let's try the nitro. Kampai. Cheers. Mm. I still get a little bit of acidity with this. I do too. The creamy mouthfeel mm. is so nice. Mm -hmm. If I had the choice to choose between a cold brew and iced coffee and a nitro, I'd always go nitro. Yeah. I'm becoming comfort as well. Love it. So we just came from Stumptown where we tried a bunch of really awesome cold coffee drinks. And now Danielle and I are standing outside Starbucks in Soho. <laughs> Take two. In 1986, Starbucks put iced coffee on its menu. In 2015, cold brew. This summer, Starbucks launches Nitro Coffee. Now, what do you think of the cold brew? For me, the cold brew has much stronger flavor. You lose some of the acidity that you actually have in a yeah. more traditionally um, brewed iced coffee. Over to Nitro. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Salute, I feel like we're drinking a beer at a bar, <laughs> but we're not. <laughs> it tastes like there's dairy or cream or something added in there. It's just the magic of nitrogen. And it's not sweetened at all either, but it, but it has a subtle sweetness. I feel like somebody that would traditionally drink their coffee with sugar could drink this without sugar. And without dairy if they yeah. can't have dairy. Yeah. yeah, it's a good replacement. A scoop of vanilla ice cream. <laughs> Game changer. Oh my gosh. That's the way to do it. Our final thoughts are that Stumptown's cold brew was smooth and complex, whereas Starbucks was harsh and astringent. However, Starbucks Nitro was creamy and sweet, while Stumptown's Nitro ended up being creamy but acidic. Thanks for watching. <laughs> If you like this video, click here to learn more about Third Wave Coffee. When second wave brands made their way into supermarkets and onto retail shelves, this paved the way for third wave coffee. Companies like Stumptown and Intelligentsia pegged their quality to their unique retail experience.